Hello you two. Whether you are at home now, have been at home for a long time, or you're just at home for a little while because we need to be home from school and keeping safe, I just thought I'd share with you a little story which explains some of the things surrounding COVID and the coronavirus and things you might be unsure of. So this story is called What's Going On? And it explains COVID really in a way that we can find easier to understand. So all I keep hearing from friends and on the news are coronavirus updates and I feel pretty confused. Schools have been closed and I can't see my friends. It all feels quite scary. Who knows when it will end? So let me think what's going on. We're shut in the house, having to make our own fun. No football, no sport, no McDonald's or more. No parties, no park times. It's all such a bore. But it's so very important to keep people well that we follow what's said even for a short spell. I see people worried and people are scared, but this might just be because it seems unfair. It's natural to worry. There's no problem with that. If I talk to my loved ones, it will help me relax. If there's no one around when I'm feeling quite scared or nobody to talk to, I can cuddle my bears. I can tell them my worries and they'll keep them all safe. If I've said them out loud, I'll feel in a good place. If it's filling my brain and I must find things to do, I could colour or draw or try puzzles out too. I could find a good board game or learn to play cards, design my own comic or play in the yard. There are so many videos people have put on YouTube to help us children while we can't be at school. There are exercise classes, dancing and ballet, maths, science and English, music learning to play. These people are awesome and will keep me busy for weeks. Time will pass quickly and it won't feel so bleak. Despite all of these efforts, we must keep ourselves well. We must learn about the virus, but try not to dwell. Some people show no symptoms. Some just have a cough. Some get quite poorly and that's why we're standing off. No mixing with people to stop germs from spreading. No seeing my old relatives, it's just what I'm dreading. If we do have to shop and we see people we know, we can wave from afar and just say hello. I must wash my hands well, especially before food, when I've played in the garden and definitely when I've pooed. It may seem hard and really quite sad, but if we do this right now, it will stop being so bad. It won't last forever. The end can be seen. Lots of great scientists have made a vaccine. It's just a few weeks. It might feel like a lifetime, but if we do this right now, we'll be out again in no time. So there's lots of important messages there and a few tricky words. So if there's anything you're unsure of, just ask your grown up and have a chat about it. And if you want to chat to us, we are here too. take care, everybody.